Okay, I was not thinking of celebrating or doing absolutely anything for today, but my mom, she started sending me pictures of when I was a kid, we celebrated my birthdays in Disney World, and now, now I'm feeling sad, well not sad, but melancholic. And I look past on a lot of photos. Yeah, the wind is crazy. A lot of photos my mom sent me but when I was a kid with my dad. Well, and my mom as well. Disney World. Because we went for a long time, like for a big span of years, to Disney World to celebrate my years, my, my birthday. Because the vacation period was exactly my birthday. So we took my birthday as like the vacation week of the year or the vacations the vacations of the year were on my birthday. And man, I saw a picture of my dad carrying me. He was young. He was he was a really young man. Well, not that young, but you know, you get it in comparison to now. He had hair, you know. He he, he looked really skinnier than what he is right now picking me up when I was a little boy when he could pick me up now I'm, you know, now he can pick me up I'm big as well damn man time goes on so fast now you're you don't live with your parents damn and this is an occasion to be grateful for every single birthday you passed with your dad and your mom um, they they made you they gave you the best birthdays until until you turn 18 every single birthday you had was perfect it was great man everything you have is thanks it's thanks to them um, last year just one year ago exactly I was partying with my friend Marcelo in my neighborhood uh, before I turned 18, like on the 21st of January of last year. Today is 22nd of January of 2023, and on on, tw on the like on the midnight of 20 from 22nd to the 23rd of the last year my birthday I was talking with a friend of Costa Rica as well with a long call talking just talking gossiping all of that for like a long a long time so I call I called my friend like at 10 p.m. and I like until until I turned 18 like in, after midnight and you were in hot springs probably the best hot springs hot springs in the world you did your first vlog your first vlog man you've done a lot of vlogs from that date from now. <sighs> on, what, like 15 vlogs, something like that. That's good. Or 12 vlogs. I think it's more like 12 vlogs. You know, you get a point. Now, yeah, man. Now you're turning 19, man. It's the first birthday. I feel like not celebrating. Like I feel I don't feel like celebrating it. I think it's growing up, you know. Now birthday, it's well, we, we, from your zero until you're 18. You every birthday it's important. After you're 18, birthdays start to feel different. I think. Now I feel like man, you're turning into a dude. Well, you are a dude, but you're turning into an old person. And you have to be responsible and you have to take good decisions. And this birthday, I sadly will not celebrate it in a big way, probably. First birthday without my parents, that hurts me. That really does hurt me. Christmas didn't hurt me that much since I was like. 10, 11, I didn't care no more about Christmas. Since I knew Santa doesn't exist, 
Christmas for me was bullshit. But my birthdays, they are important for me. My birthdays, every single year, it's my big day, you know? It's a day I... I'm an only child as well. It's like the day I... I celebrate myself. It's a day I am with my parents. They... You go to Disneyland when you're a kid. It's a day your parents give you a nice... You know, you spend some nice time with your parents. That's what birthdays were until tomorrow. Tomorrow, you're turning 19, man. Last year's a teenager. There are teenagers dominating the world right now, man. <sighs> that means you have to work harder. That means you want to be great, you want to be glorious. You know, I've always said when I die, there's a word to describe my life. I want it to be glorious. I have a long way to go, man. But not that long, man. Now they're, yeah, I'm in the beautiful park here in my city in France. But it's not my city, it's a city I'm in. I don't own it, but... There are teenagers dominating the world. You should be one of them. This year, man. You have to work hard, man. But the most important thing, I think, is give your parents the life they gave you. That would be probably my goal for the next 10 to 15 years give them a really good life, man. That's the sign of God. I don't care what nobody says. I don't give a shit. Probably another reason why I didn't feel like celebrating. Um, you know, when you get older, you tend to see like, yeah, what makes the difference between you know, the 22nd of January and the 23rd or the 24th of January with the 23rd, like, who cares? Both are the same day, it's just a day, but for me it's not, man. For me it's, it's a day it brings back the memories. It's a day I, I just have a good time with myself, with my family, to celebrate being alive. And yeah, I spent, I spent, shout out to Ethan, he gave me this look, great British look. He, 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 he did something really, really fucked up. Well, he fucked up with my, with my mind a little bit. Because I spent his birthday with him and he didn't tell me it was his birthday. So I was in the house of Ethan. And he didn't tell me it was his birthday, man. Oh, it, uh, I was like, damn! He could have at least told me and gave me a sense of like. Sometimes when people get older, they stop celebrating dates like your birthday. But I think you shouldn't do that, man. I think you should have a special day because you're going to die soon. You never know. You never know when you're gonna die. This may be my last year in the world. I, I may be dead tomorrow or today. Who knows? And this special date, like your birthday, I think you should be should celebrate them. <sighs> yeah, my mind all changed when uh, when my mom sent me those photos of when I was a kid. I have to be honest. That that yeah, that almost made me cry. Now I'm a big man. Now I'm a big dude. Now I'm getting old. Your, your goal in life is to be glorious. And something that has taken me to, it's still in my mind since a long time ago is when in ninth grade I read the others for English class. And I still I still have a lot of things of the others in my mind. Until this date, and probably until the day I die. But yeah, you you want to be glorious. You have to 
to search for we're going to adventure through the wild and difficult stuff. But man, if at the end you go back home and your kid is raised by another person, like in the Odyssey, your wife is full of suitors, not of you, because they want to replace you. If people that work with you don't even recognize you, it's not worth it, man. You have to search glory, but take care of your house. For watching this episode of Talking and Walking with Daniel, passing my last day as an 18 year old here with this great outfit. It was, you know, inspired by Ethan. Great British look, but as well, um, you know, and Ethan, you should celebrate your birthdays. They're special dates. It will give you a little joy.